Hello, YouTubers. This is Champion DJK coming at you with a 2016 new mainline casting review. And uh, first up, we got the High Roller. And here it is. Here is your High Roller. It is, uh, of course, new for 2016. It is number 118 out of 250. It is 8 of 10 on the Hot Wheels Showroom Series. Let's take a look here. High roller with a long body and classic lines. This luxury high boy coupe was made for rolling down the boulevard in style. All right, there it is. High wheel showroom, 8 to 10. I'll take her out here. And here it is. Um, it's pretty cool. It's a high boy style coupe like the Great Gat Speed, which was a new model for 2015. Um, the body does kind of appear metal, but it's actually a chrome plastic. Uh, it's a metal base, plastic sides. Kind of neat. Um, yeah, at first glance, it definitely looks metal, but it's not. It's, but they did do a good job of that chrome. Uh, the only tampos you got are, looks like top tampos right here, the blue. And there's a Hot Wheels tampo on the side there, on one side of it. Um, and actually, the windows, this is the only real window in it that's actually open. The rest of these are actual tampos, including the side one here. That's kind of goofy. Um, the seats are uh, inside the car, metal, and part of the base. Which uh, I don't think you're going to be able to see in there, but... There that is. And that's that. So it's an unlicensed model, of course. There's no real vehicle. It's uh, basically a high boy coupe. And uh, here's an image of one here. Um, high boy is just means the body kind of sits atop the frame. And uh, they have typically open wheels. So there's no fenders covering the, the rear or the front wheels. And that's pretty that. So I just got a couple pictures of them. And uh, that's pretty much it. So it's a high boy coupe. It's just like the Great Gatsby. And the Great Gatsby, I think, is in the Hot Wheels Showroom Series 2. And it's just right next to it um, in number. So there's probably a reason for that. They kind of go together. Two fantasy castings. And, of course... As always, we're going to, you know, rate the casting on a scale of one to three stars like I did last year. Uh, this year, I'll, I think I'm only going to do basically new castings or things that are new to the main line, uh, brand new. So it won't be too many historical reviews. I may pick out a couple of castings to do historical reviews on. Um, but this one, we're going to rate... Uh, well, one star means I don't like it, two stars means it's okay, and three stars mean it's great. And uh, I think we're going to go with just, uh, I'm going to be harsh and just give it one star. Uh, this one actually, to me, looked better in the package uh, than after I took it out and realized that the windows are like tampoed on, uh, the top isn't metal, which is kind of disappointing. It looks all right, I guess, but I guess I'm really not too into it at all. So I'm going to rate it one star. As always, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Are you digging the high roller? Did you pick it up? Are you going to pick it up? Or are you going to leave it behind? So, um, I only picked up this one to have loose and just to do this review. And other than that, I left every other one I've ever seen behind. So, anyway, thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.